Alrighty ladies and gents, how are you guys doing today? In this video we are going to cover another video on the new MacBook Air 2012 low end 13 inch and the specs of the machine are on your screen. However, in this video we are going to do a stress test and if we load up the temperature gauge here so you can see the average CPU speed is 49 degrees if you go down to CPU, battery roughly about 27 degrees, memory 36, palm rest 25, thunderbolt is not going to be useful because we have no thunderbolt peripherals connected. So the first test we're going to do is close down the website, open up the applications folder and pretty much open all of these apps at the same time and I'm going to remain silent during the test so you can see if the fans kick in and how loud they are. This is the first time doing it, so after three, one, two, and three. So there we have it folks, not too long, just under a minute to open all of these applications. Let's try and open up the temperature gauge again to see what the temperature is like. And there we go, 98 degrees, is that what it's shown as? Let's open this up, the window is here, wow, it's gone up to 96 degrees. Let me zoom in so you guys can see, or it is already zoomed in, there you go, 96 degrees. It was 49 before the test, CPU, wow, <laughs> all the way up to 100 and as you can see Snake is here as well on the screen, good old Snake as found in all Nokia phones, the battery is mm, roughly about 29, same as it was, the memory has gone up a little, the palm rest has gone up just a wee bit I think, um, but largely the CPU is the biggest um, performance factor in this test. So. so I've closed in all the applications and as you can see the temperature gauge has come down to about 50 to 60 degrees and what a difference that is. Let's move on to the second test in which I have a videos folder with roughly about 20 odd files or 20 videos that I've done on my YouTube channel and we are going to open them up at the same time. So let's get them all going and they will auto play once I start. Uh, and I don't expect them to all run simultaneously, but here we go. All opening up. Well, hey, this might just burn my MacBook Air. Temperature is still the same, or ha has gone up to 70 degrees. Going up to 82 degrees, I can see up here in the taskbar. This is not good. 89 degrees. And um, these are just different videos from Apple Weekly to reviews that I've done on the channel. And there we go, we've got the warning from temperature gauge, the application that I'm using to measure the temperature. And it's pretty much telling me to calm it down some. It's just a MacBook Air, it's not a Mac Pro. Keep it cool. And ladies and gents, look at that, would you? Look at that, 96 degrees, up to 99 degrees average CPU, heatness and the video is lagging as you can tell because it's trying to play 25 different videos at the same time. Um, but yeah guys, I've done this video because some of you have requested a stress test and of course this is really not a real time experience that you're going to be personally going through. If you are going to be doing this, opening up various video files at the same time, 
And then this is probably not the machine to go for. But this is kind of putting it to the max. Uh, and as needless to say, it's just not going to work. And we have reached 100 degrees. Ladies and gents, that is a record. But guys, that's it all for this video. Thanks so much for watching. I would highly appreciate if you go into iGear.com. Even if you're not going to get anything, I would appreciate if you could just hit the like button, the Facebook, the tweet button. That would be very kind of you uh, to support uh, the iGear stuff. You can also join me on twitter.com slash i6lastwegian and check out my other videos on iglasswegian.com. Feel free to leave your comments. What Mac did you get? What Mac are you thinking of getting? And while I say this outro, can you guys hear the MacBook Air fans starting to scream? It is definitely starting to feel it. I will see you in the next video, guys. Cheers.